Good morning. I'm Mr. Sudhagar, Assistant Professor, Department of Mechanical Engineering, Akshaya College of Engineering Technology. Now I am going to uh, teach the subject of disaster risk reduction and management systems. Uh, we are going to uh, discuss the all the details about uh, what is disaster and uh, what is uh, uh, how to re reduce the risk uh, in the, regarding that disaster. We are going to do, see that in video. Right. Uh, objectives of this uh, disaster subject is to impart the knowledge and concept uh, related to disaster and disaster risk reductions and disaster management. Uh, we are all going to study about the uh, how to create the disaster. We are, is there having any varieties of disaster like uh, man-made disaster or a natural disaster? and how to recuse uh, well uh, in disaster risk. Uh, these are going to discuss this uh, unit. And second thing, uh, uh, we are having uh, skill, we, we need to get a skill uh, to recuse the uh, humans or any other things. Uh, that is the second objectives of this subject. I am going to teach the unit about hazards and vulnerability and disaster risk. Right? What is a disaster? Disaster is a uh, uh, thing which is occurring uh, in sudden time or a short time to functioning the community or society involving to human or material, economic or environmental losses. Uh, if so, uh, they are having a lot of types of disaster uh, in this. Uh, each and every disaster having the lot of uh, uh, what, what I said, a lot of uh, problems uh, to create the living things and uh, uh, non-living things. Okay, uh, some uh, these are classified into the two main uh, types. Uh, first one is natural disaster. Uh, second one is man-made disaster. The natural disaster, uh, we are, as a human, we are not able to control these uh, types of disaster because they are, they are in, uh, obtained or occurred uh, due to the naturally. Example, tsunami in 2012, we, uh, we, uh, we faced the tsunami. Uh, in that time, uh, we are uh, lost, 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 lot of people living and lot of things like this. And same thing uh, we have to face in flood uh, due to heavy rain uh, and earthquake and cyclone, drought, uh, heat wave, uh, landslides and uh, forest fire uh, like this. Uh, these are the, the natural disasters. We are going to discuss uh, in details in uh, next, next slides. Uh, second thing is the man-made disaster. And the man-made disaster is uh, uh, purely developed by only the human beings uh, because uh, now we are in a technological advantage. Uh, in that technological advantage, having a lot of uh, negativity, uh, in that uh, we are having a lot of disaster because, uh, in, uh, example, uh, road accidents uh, and uh, chemical accidents, railway accidents, like this. Um, in India, uh, we are uh, uh, having a certain percentage, maximum percentage is uh, uh, man-made disasters only. Uh, especially the road accidents are having a, a more number of uh, count uh, recorded uh, in uh, up to 2022 here. Uh, these are all some exa examples of road accidents. It just shows, uh, shows the uh, uh, man-made, uh, also the yeah, man-made disasters. Uh, that means uh, they are all just uh, cut the trees in plant. Uh, uh, they build a building. Uh, there is no friction in uh, land. Uh, so due to that, uh, the landslide will be occurring. So this is also having a type of man-made disaster. Once we are uh, disturbing the nature means, we are only to face the consequences uh, take in the disasters, right? Uh, this picture shows the uh, flood. Uh, this is uh, called a natural disaster only. Uh, due to the heavy rain, uh, the flood will be developed. Uh, the, uh, the flood 
learned how to develop means the hill station the rain falling area is uh, called as catchment and area uh, all the rains are uh, fall into the catchment and then and collected into huge amount of uh, water uh, the water flow uh, where the place in downstream uh, easily uh, each and every catchment area collected and combined with in particular places that will be created the flood why the flood is created means that is also having an involvement of one human. Uh, while we are going to uh, lock the way of uh, uh, river means, uh, the river will be exposed to some other places. That places uh, uh, occupy the, uh, while coming the uh, flood, the building and other human living places are to be filled. That is called having uh, more, most dangerous for living things. This is called as uh, fire in forest department. Uh, forest. Uh, this is also in the natural disaster only because uh, no one can uh, 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 no one can fire the uh, trees in forest. It will be automatically happened while uh, two trees are in uh, um, uh, in some friction uh, due to the. Um, Summer, se summer season, the heat will be more. Uh, due to that spark, the easily it will be generate the spark in forest. Once it will be ignited, that will be uh, flowing very easily and uh, short easily uh, to the all the uh, forest. That is then uh, forest fire. Uh, in forest fire, uh, we are having an, uh, we are not having that much of technological uh, equipment to control the, these fires. Uh, in uh, in suppose in uh, nearby the roadways uh, the fire service will be help to support the uh, of the fire uh, or, or else in deep forest we are not able to go the fire uh, service uh, vehicles and that time uh, there is an, uh, no option to control this fire in foreign countries the helicopter through helicopter the uh, fire will be controlled in little bit uh, anyway, it will be happened once will forest uh, fire happens means uh, that created the uh, huge amount of loss in the forest. Uh, this picture show, shows the landslide. Uh, we are uh, recently uh, aware uh, faced in landslide in Idiki um, district, Vainadu. Uh, this is also in a um, natural disaster. Uh, I, these types of disasters are uh, happening uh, while we are disturbing the nature means uh, these types of disasters will happen. Uh, so in that subject, uh, I'm going to teach, I'm going to tell one strong thing, don't disturb nature. You just uh, live with nature, you love nature. That is the subject we're going to teach the, all the students in, as per syllabus. Next thing, uh, it is a hazard. Uh, we are all know what is mean by hazard. Uh, hazard is a, uh, it's a one thing, one type of dangerous thing, uh, which is, uh, if suppose happening in any other means, it will be causes to death or any other uh, problems uh, created in the, in the man or uh, any other thing. That is called as hazard. Uh, hazard in happens in various departments. Uh, it's a industry side uh, also having uh, hazards and uh, naturally we are having uh, hazards. Uh, so uh, just hazard is a dangerous phenomenon, substance, human activity or condition that may cause loss of life, injuries or health in impacts. And it is uh, it is uh, uh, related to it is uh, subjected to property damage and the social economic disruption on environmental damages, right? Next is uh, resilience. Uh, resilience is the ability of individuals, communities, organizations, and the states to adapt and recover the uh, from hazards. Uh, it is uh, in the resilience, uh, we are uh, all the human beings are having uh, some type, uh, some amount of, uh, sorry, some cuts of resilience because uh, we are mostly uh, don't uh, uh, involved in that uh, natural disasters. Uh, 
in some other places in some pupils are uh, faced a uh, lot of disasters in that particular time uh, what is the uh, strength of that human what is the mind of that human is called as resilience uh, once the disaster came you just uh, faced the disaster and uh, and recuse uh, from uh, any others or recuse from yourself uh, from that disaster that is called uh, resilience thank you